I can study every day, I must study every day, I should study every day. Hmm, model verbs. Hello everybody, in today's video we'll see more about model verbs. Hi everyone, in today's video we'll see how to use model verbs. Now the question is, hmm, why should I use model verbs if I can express my ideas already? Well, model verbs are amazing because with only one word, you can express a lot of meaning. For example, obligation or prohibition, ability, probability, advice, permission, all of that with only a few words. Let's take a look at them. This sentence. I exercise every day. This is to express routine. It's present simple. Now, if I want to express possibility or ability, I can exercise every day. That means either I'm fit enough to exercise every day or I have enough time for it. It's possible. I can't exercise every day. This time we have a lack of ability or lack of possibility. I can't because I'm too tired in the evenings or I'm, I don't have enough time to exercise. Now, I could exercise. This is also probability. Um, I could exercise every day, but hold on, no, I don't want to. Okay, I should exercise. This is for advice. I really should exercise every day. So almost an, a, a piece of advice I give to myself. Yeah, I must exercise or I have to exercise. This is obligation. I might exercise every day, but I'm not sure I will. This is more probability about the future. I'm thinking next month. Hmm, I might, but I don't think I will because I'm lazy. Yeah, or I may also probability. Let's take a look at some examples of sentences that people say. It's necessary to exercise to stay fit. You don't have to, but if you want to stay fit, it's a very good idea. So it's a strong piece of advice or obligation almost. Like you should exercise and you must exercise instead of it's necessary. Another one. It's possible for you to send it to me better. So now this time you ask for permission. So you can use, could you send it to me? Or can you send it to me? But could, it's a bit more polite. Could you send it to me instead of, it's possible for you, yeah? It's not possible for me to come early. This time is a lack of possibility. So, we said lack of possibility, can't. I can't come early. And finally, I advise you to sleep early. For advice, should. You should sleep early. So you see, we're different ways of expressing language. But remember that model verbs are extremely powerful. And uh, just one word and then one model verb with your verb can express the idea more directly and more clearly and more naturally. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click like or subscribe and you can leave a comment down below if you have any questions. Bye for now!